So are you unable to go out for a date night this Valentine's Day? Well, we're gonna share seven ideas of activities that you and your spouse can do at home for a date night right now. Hey friends, Kyle and AJ here with Marriage Inside Out, where we provide content to enrich, inspire, and edify your marriage and relationship. If this is your first time visiting our channel, we encourage you to subscribe and to check out a lot of the other videos that we have in our collection. We love to provide practical content that you and your spouse can use in your marriage. Okay, so we know that there are different uh, circumstances and things that can prevent us from maybe going out for a date night, whether it is a global pandemic, mm -hmm. like we're currently mm -hmm. in, you know, maybe you and your spouse have young children, or mm -hmm. there are different reasons as to why you might not be able to go out on a date. But that's okay because sometimes we just have to be creative. Mm -hmm. And so what we're gonna share with you guys are seven at home date night ideas. And one thing that's great about these is that they're also budget friendly right. as well. So you can use these date night ideas for Valentine's Day or for just any time during the year that you and your spouse just want to have a good time together. So let's get into it. The first date night idea is to log in for a virtual class, do a virtual cooking class, virtual dance lessons, no matter where you are in the spectrum of your budget, right? You can pay to get like into a master class or something like that, or you could just go to YouTube, right? You're right here. Especially for the cooking classes, you just run to the grocery store like normal, bring all the supplies that you need to the house and then go step by step. Yes, and with the dance classes, I mean, shout out to all the salsa dancing lovers yeah. out there, Latin dance, um, as well as all of our Chicago Midwest hey. steppers out there. Step in the name of love. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> and the second idea is you can do an at-home wine tasting experience. You right. can buy your favorite bottles of wine or maybe some wines that you've been wanting to try and then set it out. You can even add to a cheese board or maybe a charcuterie board just to, to spice it up even more. Exactly. And for those of you guys that might not be wine drinkers, you're not out of the taste testing option, right? Whether that's a different type of juice or kombucha or something, you can set those aside in beautiful cups and still have your snacks out and make it an experience together. Kombucha and wine glass, that sounds all right right there. Right? Like Seriously. That. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And the next date night idea is to have a game night. Pull out that Monopoly, those cards, whatever uh, is your favorite games and get to it. Make sure that you are picking a game that you both feel like you would enjoy. Yes, I mean, even Spinner Dominoes, for example. Yeah, yes. Shout out to Montel and Jasmine Powers for getting us that game. Yes, you know, just so good. Different things, Dominoes itself. Classic Dominoes is my fave. Yeah, you like classic Dominoes. Yes. All day. Yeah. <laughs> All right, and the next idea is similar to the game night, you can actually do a couples game. So there are different card games that are designed for couples to generate discussion right. and intimate discussion with one another. For example, there is a love language card set. Mm -hmm. The Azanwu couple just released the game called the Ignite Intimacy Challenge. Those are some really good things to do as well. Yeah, yeah, and it's great to have that card set around, like we said, throughout the year, because a lot of the questions that they have are ones you don't really think about um, on a normal day-to-day -day basis. And the next Next date night idea is to have a movie night. The movie night is always a good date night. You can make some popcorn, get some snacks from the gas station, and just really have a good time. Right, and I mean, even if you don't want to sign up for a year-long subscription yeah. for a streaming service, you can just do a one-month subscription Seriously. and then cancel it right after that. I know we've done that. But it still works the same because you might spend only $10 for yeah. that, and that's less than you would spend actually going to the movies and buying tickets, so exactly. don't knock the movie night. And then the next idea is to have an at-home spa evening. Get some bubble bath solutions, you can get some bath salts, essential oils, and you can get one of those you know, foot massagers where you put the water in and it mm -hmm. vibrates. You can give one another a massage, couples massage, just a nice romantic exactly. thing to do. So spa night is a definitely a good go-to. Yeah, and the beauty about doing a spa night is that you can set the atmosphere. You can put on a diffuser or light candles, set the mood, dim the lights, so that you guys can you know just just enjoy that moment of solitude if you will together as you're growing in intimacy on that date and the last date night option is to do a virtual date night with friends any of these date night ideas we've shared previously yep. you can play the couples game together you can do a cooking class together right all of those things can be an experience you share with another couple yep and the moral of this video is you know sometimes when you get lemons you just got to make lemonade you, you got to get creative just because there are certain 
circumstances that might prohibit you from being able to go out like you want to doesn't mean that you still can't create moments, quality moments with one another at home. And we'd love to know from you guys, have you tried any of these date night ideas? If so, what is your favorite? We'd love to know. Yes, and if you got value out of this video, we'd appreciate if you like, comment below, and also share this with someone else that you know that you feel like it could help. Thank you guys again for tuning in. We look forward to catching up with you soon.